Your Excellency, the honored Chinese uh, Consul General, Mr. Eric, Mr. Andy from Hutchison, all dignity here, all participants here, uh, it's my pleasure to welcome you here today to Ras al Khaimah and to witness uh, the new page of, uh, of the economic uh, future of Ras al Khaimah, where we are celebrating the presence of uh, Hutchison operating uh, uh, from the port of Minas Hagar. We have great uh, hope and expectation for the role uh, of Hutchison to be the operator, the, the premier uh, port operator in container globally. It will enhance our ability uh, to connect to the world and get the world connected to us. As we strive to make our shelf more competitive for our own uh, industry, for our own businessmen, and for the new businessmen and businesswomen who will grow, they will find Hutchison a true partner who cares about relationship, who cares about service, who cares about growing, because they have done the story themselves a long time ago. So they have a great uh, textbook for success, where they have arrived, where they started from. Over the come last two years, I have a great interaction with them. And it is really my joy today that we today sit here to celebrate that, uh, the fruit of our negotiation. That the team from Minasagar and all the departments, and I commend all those participants who participate and put their energy, not excluding anyone. All of them were vital and were very important to bridge all the differences sometimes linguistic, sometimes legal, but we got where we are. One of our objectives is to create a business hub, a business infrastructure that will attract investors and entrepreneurs from everywhere. They will bring with them lines of trade and commercial connection that need to be serviced and developed. Hutchison Port Shrack and its plans for future development in Minas Agar are a key piece in our logistic strategy, which will encourage those with interest to make the commitment to Ras al-Khaimah. This partnership is one more indicator that Ras al-Khaimah is committed to offering the infrastructure, the services, and the skilled workforce that allow commerce and industry to thrive in this emirate. And for those businesses that are already established here that depend on the import and export of, of goods and services, the container terminal operation will quickly become an inviting option to be considered as they pursue the commercial activities. Actually, a few days ago, I was reflecting on the fact that this agreement forges yet another link between China and the Emirates, and in particular, Ras al Khaimah. Some of you may think that this relation is a new phenomenon, but sorry, you are wrong. Only a couple of months ago, I had an interesting visitor. The deputy director of the Palace Museum in Beijing visited Ras al Khaimah, and actually he visited me. And his interest is to talk about the archaeological history of Ras al-Khaimah and how it's China. He came because he was fascinated by the fact that our National Museum has about almost like 40,000 pieces of Chinese pottery in storage from our archaeological digs, namely at Julfar, but other digs do here. A few kilometers from here not far. So he was actually very fascinated, blown away. So he took some samples back to Beijing to investigate their points of origin in China. He is probably one of the most prominent 
in China on Chinese pottery. For him to find something here to connect him, it was his greatest joy. It's, it's beyond any doubt. I mean, the fact that this, like, the presence of those pottery signifies that our relationship actually was very much alive a thousand years ago. When connectivity was much difficult, it shows the thriving environment of trade between Russell Khema and China then. So today, we're actually celebrating renewal of this trade that existed for 100 years ago. That's something our grandfathers have done very successfully. So I, th I thank our Hutchinson partners here to, do, to become the new bridge between China and Rathlheim. In closing here, I wish actually Hutchinson Port all the success it deserves. And that the Russell Hemi become another success story in their many successes they have achieved. And that this will be a very long standing and fruitful partnership that will benefit Russell Hema, Hutchison, and everybody here. Thank you very much. Thank you, Your Highness.